What is up you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now today I want to talk about how to give yourself love and compassion. Now when we talk about love and compassion, I mean really loving yourself. Like giving love and compassion to yourself. You may be able to give love and compassion to other people, but have you done that to yourself? It's a question. I made a post on Facebook about you can how can you love the darkest part of somebody else, but not love the darkest part of you? And a lot of people started commenting, well, I was never taught this. And, you know, because, you know, it's easier to, yes, it's easier to give love to somebody else, but it's harder to look within yourself. Because once you realize that you also have darkness with inside you, you're going to think that you're not able to be loved. And that is not true. Everybody is worthy of love. You are worthy of love. If you can sit with yourself and look at all your darkest parts, not just your brightness and your light and stuff, but also look at your darkest parts and treat them with love and compassion, I promise you your whole perspective about self-love is going to change dramatically. Now, lately I've been doing so much inner work and self-love work to really sit with myself and be compassionate. I used to be that person who can give everybody else the love and assurance and, and uh, the acceptance for their darkest parts. But I was always scared to go inside because there's a lot of dark parts about me that I thought, how could someone ever love this part about me? How? Until I really sat and be like, if you can love that with somebody else, why can't you love it within you? Everyone has dark parts like inner alchemy, like the yin and yang, we are have darkness and brightness, feminine and masculine. We just need to balance those things out and love your imperfections. Genuinely sit and be like, I love you. Affirm yourself, have affirmations. I have compassionate for myself. I am compassion. Like I am compassionate with myself. My bad, messed up the word. I am compassionate with myself. I have love for myself. I have love for the world. Enough to give to myself as well. Remember, in order to be the best version of yourself or to ooze the best type of love out into the world, you must ooze that love inside you. And I promise you, you will shine like a ray of sunshine. Okay? Because once you start to love yourself, genuinely love, I'm talking about every single follicle form dark light middle every ground of yourself then only then you will finally feel what love feels like like sit with yourself you know what i was driving just just earlier i was driving and i was like mariba i love you mara i am so proud of you just know that i'm here and i am never going anywhere me and you are always going to be be together you would never have to worry about me ever leaving you. Affirm, and when I'm talking to myself, I talk to myself like I'm talking to my inner child for my highest self. You have to talk to yourself with love and compassion. And talk to yourself like you're a kid. Because the, the traumatized version of yourself, it is they are still a kid. They're still a child. It's your inner child who feels like they're not lovable. So you have to make them feel lovable and do the things that people do when they love someone whether that's small affirmations whether that's holding yourself at nighttime or crying and giving yourself space to cry and telling yourself it's okay to cry i'm here i'm here and i'm not going anywhere give yourself that soft delicate sweet love and you will feel so whole within yourself you would never have to feel like you have to get validation from anyone exterior from yourself because you know you hold that space for yourself. Yes, you can accept compliments, but you have that space within yourself that no matter what happens, no matter who leaves, who disappears, or what goes left and what goes right, whether you have a lot of money or no money, you are whole within yourself. And that's what matters. That is the video that I wanted to talk about today. I hope you guys 
take this video if it resonates with you and use what I said to you and start putting in that love and compassion towards yourself because you deserve it. You deserve to be loved and I love you. Have an amazing day. If you like this video, please like, comment, whatever video you wanna see next or what you would like me to talk about again. Again, you guys are beautiful. I appreciate you guys. And I do this for y'all and for me because it's serving my highest good. Peace.